Sometimes a photograph, well, it just isn't enough. These painters are preserving State Fair images on a canvas. Plein air is the French word meaning to paint outdoors in the plain air, open space. This is an opportunity and a way for people to get out and in touch with nature and be able to paint from real life. This is a little out of my uh, comfort zone. I'm usually used to painting in the studio, but it's just wonderful. There's an energy here uh, at the State Fair. So we have 10 artists that are dispersed throughout the fairgrounds and they'll be painting. They started at 10 o'clock this morning and they'll finish it before, but they have to turn in their paintings at five o'clock, finished, completed artworks, and then they'll be on display for the rest of the fair. And people can come in to the Iowa, to the Fine Arts Department at the Cultural Building and they, they'll be able to vote for their favorite plein air painter. It can be a challenge. Um, for one thing, your light changes so much. Within uh, two hours, your light's completely different. You got a whole new painting. So it's a challenge to kind of work with that. So what I do is I take uh, photos on my iPad, and if I need to know how far the shadows have moved, I can go back to what it looked like when, it, when I first saw it. They had envelopes, and we just basically kind of drew out of a hat, and uh, there are 10 artists and kind of five locations around the fair. And then we could pick anywhere in that set location. So mine said uh, livestock barns. And so I chose the big bull today to give him a portrait. <laughs> kind of up here, the fine arts is up here on the hill away from everything and some people are a little maybe intimidated by it, you know, being it's fine arts and they don't realize that, you know, it's art is part of every day and part of the way we, it's part of the state fair. So we thought this way, you know, we could take art to everybody and they'd be able to see what it's all about and get excited and come up and see the rest of it.